And now to the product of the week. And today's product is, it's the Baxter's Hard Water Pomade. It's a firm hold with a shine finish. Now actually, it's exactly the same tub as the rest of the Baxter's products. Again, glass, plastic top, real nice elegant packaging. I've always really liked a lot of their stuff. Again, it is called a pomade as the rest of all of them are called pomades, but actually this is more what I would actually consider a pomade to be. It is water-based. It's very much looks like a pomade as well when you go inside of it. I love the color. It's blue. It's got a little bit of glitter inside of it. I think it looks really cool. Uh, and it's not generally the sort of product I would go for, but I was intrigued by the color of it and the smell of it. The smell of it is actually really nice. It's got quite a, a sherbet smell to it. It's like a lemon sherbet, it's got a real tang to it, so that really intrigued me from the start as well. And the way that they describe it is, the Baxter of California hard water pomade helps to give your hair definition and pliable hold for styles that stay in place all day. It's easily washed out and won't leave a sticky or stiff residue in your hair. Formulated with water and elastic fibers, it texturizes your hair by separating strands and blending in effortlessly. You'll be in control of your hair from morning until night and you can switch up your style to match your mood thanks to the pliable texture. So I am interested to see how this works. It's not something I would normally go for. I'd go for something a little bit more of a matte finish. The shine is not really something I go for, but I wanted to try this. So I'm gonna go and try and put it in now and see how it works. Because it's a water-based product, obviously when you grab it out of the tub, it's very easy to get out, scoop it out super easy. When you then spread it across your hands, actually it, it very much smears across your hands. It's very much a, a sticky texture and it feels as though it then completely goes like a sort of a mush completely across your hands actually. It's very sticky. Um, it's when you when you work it, you, you first push it on and it it gets harder and harder as you go as you go like it's sort of there's more friction there it's sort of it's sticky it's like you're going into slush uh where it's then it just like it quite it's, it's a bit then harder to actually work it through your hands uh putting it through the hair it, it seems to go in and sort of stop so it's, it doesn't like it doesn't feel like it coats all of the hair you have to sort of keep going back in to make sure you get more of it in, into the top it sort of it goes in you like stuck 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 um, which is not necessarily not necessarily a bad thing. It just sort of it, you you just sort of have to put quite a bit on to actually feel as though it is getting in through the hair. It feels like it gets firm straight away, uh, and then to put it in, it's it's it's, it's 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 definitely changed texture now. And even the, the probably the five minutes since putting it in, it feels like a lot softer now. Um, I think because you have to put so much on to actually f to get it on to to cover all of the hair. I feel like it's any, it's going to weigh it down. I think when I put it on, at first it very much looked like there was product in there and it looked very much um, very PC, a lot of texture, and it looked, but it looked like they had a lot of product in there. I feel like now it's sort of, it's got a bit weaker, but because you've had to put so much in there, it's then it's going to fall a little bit flatter. Um, you can run your hands through it quite easily. Um, and doesn't really get any residue on the, on your hands. It was it's water based, so actually it washes off your hands very easily. I'd imagine it's going to wash out of the hair very easily as well. I'm going to be interested to see how this does last throughout the whole day. So we'll check in at the end of the day and see how it does last. Well, uh, it's the end of the day, and as you can see, this does not quite look how it was when I started up earlier. Uh, and it's been a very unstrenuous day to be totally honest with you. I've just been editing videos and just been around the flat. So I've done absolutely nothing and it has not held up at all. It's like it's just went completely flat. Uh, I think this probably would work if you wanted more of a flatter look and if you wanted to look like some product, if you had like more of a slick back look, but also I, if that's the look you were going for, there's probably other products, 10 other products that I can think off the top of my head that I would use probably before putting this one in.